True Halloween Horror Stories Halloween is a time to celebrate the dead, and things can get pretty scary around this time. People dress up in costumes, houses are decorated in the most terrifying way possible, and the streets are filled with all sorts of horrifying things. However, some strange things are always going on, and it can get even scarier. But how frightening can it really get? Mom sends her love. During Halloween, some people decide to go on the hunt for ghosts, and more often than not, they will find one. Teenage Kevin and his friends had heard stories about a dangerous turn on the nearby highway from where they live. It was said that on this highway, there were many accidents that occurred over the years. This made them believe that it was haunted. The most famous story was about a mother who took her own life after her son had crashed his car and died there. Since then, it was said around town that her ghost remained at this deadly turn to protect people from ending up like her son. So Kevin and his friends decided to put this theory to the test. At night, Kevin and his friends drove out to the highway. When the group of boys arrived at the turn, they pulled over. To prove their theory, they had brought a bag of flour with them and they proceeded to sprinkle the white powder on the road, the grass, and the car. The whole idea was to get some sort of footprint to prove that the ghost was real. Once everything was set, they got back into the car and began to take the car around the turn. All this time, Kevin was accelerating until he wasn't moving anymore. A loud thump brought them to a halt, but there was nothing in front of them. When they got out of the car, they saw two woman-sized handprints and the white flower on the hood. Mistaken Decoration In 2005, the people of Delaware were celebrating Halloween as usual, decorating their houses and carving out pumpkins. However, at one home, there was some sort of body that was hanging from a tree. According to all the passers-by, this was just another Halloween decoration. However, little did they know that this was actually a woman's body who had decided to take her own life. According to reports, it is said that the woman, who was 42 years old, used rope to hang herself across the street from some homes that were on a moderately busy road. The body was suspended about 15 feet above the ground and could easily be seen by passing vehicles. However, given that Halloween was coming up, even the neighbors thought it was just another Halloween prank. But it seems that that woman decided to return with the spirits on Halloween. Monsters are real. You would think that Halloween is an excellent time to go trick-or-treating with some of your friends. The kids usually knock on doors in their favorite costumes, hoping to get a few candies to eat. We all know that kids love candy, so giving them some is no harm. However, some people have other intentions for the kids. There have been some reported cases of kids dying from spike candy on Halloween, making this a parent's worst nightmare. One event that caused this fear even worse than it already was happened in 1974. This was the murder of Timothy O'Brien, who was just eight years old. Timothy, who was from Deer Park, Texas, had gone trick-or-treating with his friends. They went from door to door, getting some candy to eat along the way. However, on Halloween night, little Timothy died. His life was taken from him after he ate poison candy. This made all the parents scared. However, the true monster of this crime was not that far off. At first, the parents thought that it was some candy he had been given from another house or a neighbor's house, but it was none of the above. The true monster was in fact the boy's own father. It turns out that his father gave the young boy some spiked candy so he could later cash in on his son's life insurance. This was the most horrifying thing to happen on that Halloween night, and it definitely left everyone in shock. For more interesting stories, make sure you subscribe to our channel and hit that bell icon to get notified of new videos. Thanks for watching.